Good morning from the Wisconsin PFR site. Uh, this morning it is July 2nd and we are actually applying some boron on some R1 soybeans. So this is a rate and timing study. Um, boron is a, an important nutrient in the reproductive stage of both corn and soybeans. And this study in particular is looking at different timings as well as different rates in terms of R1 compared to R3. So with that, we're pretty confident that R3 is a good time to apply it. That's a proven practice that we've got. Uh, but what we're looking to learn is maybe R1 might be another time where applying boron might be an economically beneficial practice. Along with that, oftentimes we're finishing up a lot of our last herbicide applications right around this R1 growth stage. Many of our herbicides cut off at R1, such that if boron is a good practice to do right now, it might essentially get a free ride if you're doing an herbicide application here around this R1 timing or doing a white mold targeted fungicide application around that R1 timing. So that's a trial we're looking at this year. We're applying either one pint or a quart at either of these timings and some of them is the combination of both. So again, multiple rates, multiple timings, looking at R1 versus R3 boron timing on soybeans. So pretty good looking beans so far. 30 inch rows, they're not quite canopied yet, but all the plants essentially have a flower on them, so it's a perfect time to be doing this R1 timing. Stay tuned and check back to see what we've got. Thank you.